Hey, what is going on, pros and prices? It's Cam Jen here, just one, two, three, eight. Welcome to our drinks review. Today, it's Wheel and Riders Energy Drink. So, I got this particular drink out of a uh, random corner shop, and I believe it cost me 40p. So, I'll give you guys a full 360 of the can. So, we have some, some, uh, box of do. It's meant to be some, uh, limited edition one with his signature on it. So, it's meant to be just be, I guess, sponsored by him or something. But yeah, so we have, uh, like I said, we have him on the front. I ain't got a clue who he is. Um, and then we have a billion different languages on the back, as you can see, because he's not got it out of a corner top, but I think it, it is a Polish energy drink. But yeah, load of Ryan. I mean, look at that, guys. I had to read through all of that to get the uh, ingredients and stuff. But yeah, purpley cam with, you know, logo on the front. Nothing on the bottom and a nice red pull ring. I didn't have to do that, but it's always no nice little features which make the bigger difference. So, I think this is the original flavour. I'm assuming it is. It doesn't really say... Caffeine Turium. The caffeine content is 32 milligrams per 100 ml. So again, it's the average uh, around the top. We've got our power all around the top. Now, after reading these loads of writing, it says, food stuff intended for particular nutritional use for people exposed to strenuous physical and physical effort. I don't know if that makes sense, but it kind of sounds a bit weird. Any other stuff interesting? Contains your usual vitamins, contains... Uh, niacin, panophenic acid, vitamin B6 and B12. Sugar content is 10.8 grams per 100 ml. And I believe that is it. It doesn't contain any sweeteners. Nope, I think that's it. And like I already noticed, oh, it is a Polish. And the there's some yeah, there's some address on there from where it's from or something, whatever. But anyways, it's nice and cold. I have a cup. Let's get into it. Hopefully it doesn't explode over me. So I've got a feeling, you know, it's going to be a standard energy drink. It's going to have the same colour. It's more like a standard energy drink. But you never know. I could be wrong. So like I said, hopefully it doesn't explode over me. Oh, blimey. Oh, okay. So it is that standard energy drink colour, although it is definitely a, maybe a tad lighter, but, you know, just on that same apple colour. Uh, it is see-through, quite see-through, this one, actually. And, of course, it is fizzy. The smell... Smells like a standard... Oops, got it on my nose. <laughs> smells like a standard energy drink. Hmm. Nevertheless, guys, let's taste some. Yep, that is that is uh, definitely the standard energy drink. It actually tastes like the the Euro Shopper and the Boost ones, to be honest, and um, which is a bit of, which is a bit of a shame because I was expecting it to be like a limited edition flavor, but uh, nah, it's just nah, just the same old flavor. But yeah, it definitely tastes like the Euro Shopper twenty nine p and the and the Boosts, you know, original five p or whatever it is. Uh, Nothing else to say about that, you know, it's probably got the same, if I've done a blind test, I probably couldn't tell the difference. Yeah. Standard energy drink at the end of the day, guys, so for that reason, it does get a thumbs up, because like I said, hey, it's a standard flavour. Um, but yeah, so thanks for watching, guys, I'll see you all later.